Hi everyone, Casey Chipwright here, CEO and founder of Athlete Foundry. Marcus Ogden, former NFL athlete, inaugural brand ambassador for the Athlete Foundry. Alright Marcus, in our fifth and final drill of this five drill challenge, will be the 40 yard dash. Long distance, I think I'm pretty sure I'm up for it. How about you? I'm always up for the challenge. They called me Flash back in the day. It's time to get this thing moving and burn some ground, baby. Flash. Now, what exactly do you mean by Flash? I was here today, going tomorrow. Oh, I like that. I do have, uh, he's up, he's putting me up for a great challenge. So let's check it out. I'm, look, I'm up for it. 40 yard dash is next. Okay, we just finished the fifth and final drill, the 40-yard dash, the infamous 40-yard dash. Can't wait to declare the winner for the 40-yard dash. So with that, let's do the drum roll. The winner is... Casey. Casey, great job on the 40-yard dash. Great explosion out throughout the entire run. How'd you do it? I, I, I did practice, of course, quite a bit. I put on extra weight in throughout the month of December. Uh, because I knew it's that explosion and the explosion means I got to make it harder on myself So whatever it takes to drag me down so I can be as explosive as possible uh, But you know you did an outstanding job Marcus You were a freight train coming out of there <laughs> and you know there's a bit of piece of what we're doing it uh, Does mean that you have to a bit slow down towards the end so we don't crash into the wall But at the end of the day the numbers are the numbers and uh, it was very very close I tell you that it was essentially uh, within the nick of Millisecond, so uh, I'm, I'm glad uh, that I came out ahead. Hey! Um, but you know what? We're gonna take these numbers, drop it into the platform, my numbers and Marcus's, because we're gonna show you where they stand between sixth and twelfth grade in re respect to the performance at the, each division level, so we know how competitive we are in the road ahead for us. So, Marcus, let's go check out the platform. Let's go. Hi everyone, we just wrapped up the fifth and final skill of our five skill head-to-head -head challenge with Marcus, the 40 yard dash. We've dropped in our data, let me walk you through what it means and what it tells us. First, my platform, eighth grade student athlete, soccer, positions forward for that combination of sport and position. Here's the orange band of performance that represents the 50th percentile of development for, in this case, NCAA Division Three. So in my case, I performed at 6.91 seconds. For me to remain competitive for the Division Three level at an eighth grade spring milestone is 6.72 down to 6.49. In this case, of course, the lower the number, the better. In this case, I just missed being in the Division Three range, but that's okay because I know what the range is and I know what I need to do to improve myself and get in the band or in fact below the band in this case so it's faster from now until the 12th grade. I can also pick the different sports association levels to understand how my competitive level uh, changes and what I need to do going forward. Let me go ahead and show you Marcus's platform. Marcus is a ninth grade student athlete football tackle position so offensive line for that combination of sport and position here's his particular band and where he needs to perform in today 40 yard dash he performed 7.02 seconds and for him to be competitive for division three at the ninth grade spring milestone he needs to be performing at 6.16 to 5.94 and he also did not come in the band, but that's okay because he knows what that number is, what the range is, and he knows what it is going forward. He's got plenty of time in his student athlete journey to improve his performance to get inside of that band or below in this case, which means faster to be in the band is 50th percentile performance, and then below, of course, is even better. He can also pick Division One, Division Two. NAIA and the three junior colleges with NWAC, which is the Northwest, CCCA, which is all of California, 
and the rest of America is under the NJCA for Community College. So he can pick any of those and understand where his band is. That wraps up our five skills and the target trajectory illustration from our powerful platform at Athlete Foundry. I am absolutely delighted that we finished up the 40 yard dash, which means we can now tally the results of the underdog versus the big dog to determine who gets the bragging rights for the short period of time to be the top dog. And I am humbled to say that it was a close, close call, but the winner and who gets declared to be the top dog is... It's Casey. <laughs> Casey, you won three out of the five. We came down, it was so close. A couple tenths of a second on that 40 yard dash. But overall, you had a great event, great challenge, and you had a great showing. So congratulations, man. Hey, thanks. You know, we all brought it, brought the best out of each other, and that's what it takes is to support each other, understand where we're going, having that roadmap, seeing where the data sits, and then encouraging us through the way. So it was close, very, very close. I'll take it. Marcus was really close. I'll take it. And guess what? This is just the first of many more to come. And Marcus, I'm pretty sure my time will come, but that's okay. I'm in it for the long haul. What about you? Absolutely. I was doing these drills. It was funny how some things you were doing that came to speed was just right up your alley. Things for power were right up my alley, but it was just about the competitive nature to go out there. Even if you're facing adversity, just like in life, you face adversity, you gotta just go head on and charge at it and persevere. And don't make excuses, just push, push, push to achieve your dreams of being that collegiate athlete. That's, that's absolutely right. And, and the, what more important is to have a roadmap and have that plan right there at your fingertips, which is what Athlete Foundry does. We provide a roadmap to parents and middle school and high school student athletes between sixth and 12th grade to help them build their very best athumademic resume. What is that? That's athletic human and academic combined resume. Why? To do three things. One, increase your odds to be a collegiate athlete. Two, increase your potential for financial assistance from a college. And three, help you prepare for after sports. To learn more about Athlete Foundry, please visit our website, www.athletefoundry.com. Can't wait to see you at the next Naval U.S. Naval officer, CEO of Athlete Foundry versus former NFL player and Athlete Foundry brand ambassador competition, Marcus. Sounds great. All right.